Well guys, how's it going? Welcome back to the channel. So we're going to do a little, something a little bit different today. Um, I decided to do a little bit of a channel update, kind of a little bit of a... Just a little talky time, you know? Um, I haven't really done one of these. Um, I am starting to near, get near that 200 subscriber mark, so I'm really, really excited about that. And I want to say thank you to all, all my wonderful t subscribers. Uh, you guys have been awesome. Um, yeah, so I think I'm about seven or eight months in now to this whole YouTube thing, and uh, I'm having a blast. I'm not gonna lie. Um, I've been honestly loving challenging myself. Uh, I've done so many new things I haven't tried before. Definitely have done some stuff that I'm very uh, familiar with. But, uh, but yeah, so I just want to kind of give you guys um, a little overview of what. Now that I've been doing this for, like I said, seven or eight months, I just want to kind of give you guys an overview of where my direction with the channel is going. And also, I would like to hear from you guys, see where you guys would like to see the channel go. Um, you can obviously just put that down in the comments. Um, I know for certain one thing I might uh, start weeding out of my channel is uh, my cooking stuff. Uh, I don't get a whole lot of attention from that. Um, so, I mean, there's going to be probably some, some, like, interesting stuff I might cook in the future, but, like, my last, even my last rabbit cooking video, I think I got, like, 22 views, so, um, for me, that's just not, uh, something I'm going to focus my energy on. Uh, I have been loving doing the builds. It seems to be, um, kind of my little niche in, in a way, uh, same with my, my hunting and my fishing and stuff like that. Um, the survival stuff is a little hit and miss, but you know what, I, I absolutely love doing that. That's actually one of the reasons why I started this whole channel was, uh, I want to force myself to get more into that prepper, bushcrafter, uh, lifestyle. And I felt that, uh, starting up a YouTube channel would give me a reason, a drive to do that. Um, I've wanted to have a bushcraft shelter by now, but with COVID restrictions, we also had some fire bans and all that kind of stuff. Just and just hectic stuff with the family this year. I uh, haven't really got to get out and do that. Uh, I know Nico from Outdoor Anonymous was really interested in doing a bushcraft shelter, so I'm really hoping that we can get a couple weekends in uh, this summer slash fall, and maybe we could have a place uh, for this winter. That would be kind of fun. Um... I've uh, I haven't fished as much as I wanted to, um, but I think the fishing I've done has been in entertaining, I guess. Um, but I mean, I like I said, I'd just like to get some feedback from you guys. Uh, a couple things um, I definitely wanted to know from you guys. So for the people that have been watching the majority of my videos, uh, you'll have noticed some videos. I have put music in and some videos I haven't certain videos just doesn't feel right uh, other videos I feel there's a lot of quiet stuff happening so I want to add a bit of music to to keep a little bit entertaining uh, but what do you guys think of the music like is it something that I should be incorporating into my videos moving forward um, so that was one of the things um, another thing is uh, I mean realistically what is your guys's preference for the content that I do put out uh, like I said everything that I I do I I do for you guys but I also do for myself right it's, it's stuff that I find that's very enjoyable to do um, I guess I'm always going to be doing do 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 it yourself projects and repurposing stuff it's just it's just something I really love doing um, also like I'm definitely definitely fall in love with uh, bow making uh, anybody that's following me along will have seen um, this wall I backed uh, red oak boat that I built. Unfortunately, um, I am getting some compression cracks in here. So before it actually breaks, I'm just going to put this a wall hanger. So I got about 700 arrows out of this. Am I sad? Sure. But I got 700 arrows out of my first bow. So I'm pretty stoked about that. Right now I'm just working on Olivia's uh, bow. Now, um, also, if you stick around, I'm also doing a giveaway um, in this video. So just stick around to see what it is and how you can uh, be part of it. 
Um, but yeah, I mean, so the, like I said, this summer, um, it's, it's, so well, we're in summer now, so I got a couple videos and stuff and ideas uh, down the pipelines. I said there's going to be a few more fishing videos, going to get out to the Nopaming, I want to go after some bass. Um, now one thing I haven't started yet, but one thing I want to do um, is I am going to be putting a poster board up and basically my goal is to try to nail as many species with my fly rod as possible this year and also catalog as many master angler um, fish I can get. So for the people that aren't from Manitoba, what the master angler fish are is basically there's a program here in Manitoba that if you get uh, certain species of fish uh, above certain lengths, you can submit these pictures of lengths of the fish and then you can get uh, awards. Uh, so as of as of right now, I got one master angler perch, which to, you know what, I'm not gonna lie, that was freaking awesome. I've been wanting to get one of those for a while. Anybody who's curious what a master angler perch is, it's 13 inches and mine was 13 uh and five eights so a nice little tank uh holy shit guys i just fucking caught <laughs> the biggest perch of my freaking life we got him just just shy of 14 just shy of 14. Uh, as for the species I've already gotten uh, on the fly rod, I got freshwater drum, I got pike, I got common carp. Uh, this weekend I had gotten it. I finally got that catfish I was after and I got a gold eye. I haven't decided yet if I'm gonna release that the, the foot footage of me catching a catfish Unfortunately, the footage of me in the water catching the cat wasn't the best. I might be able to do something with it, so we'll see. Um, but yeah, like I said, the, the, the biggest thing is I want to just know what you guys want to see out of this channel. Like I said, we're, we're nearing that 200 subscriber mark. Um, I'm honestly so excited about where I'm at and the, and the amount of growth I've gotten in such a short amount of time. My original goal when I first started was I wanted 100 subscribers uh, after a year. So I've already doubled that. I, I've now made myself a steep goal, which I don't think I'm going to hit it. But I was, going, I was like, well, if I can do 100 in that timeline, let's do 500 in that year. So we'll see what happens. Um, like I said, it's I'm not going to go out there and beg for subscribers. Um, I'm all, also, um, I've also been really loving doing um, the shorts. I don't know if you guys have been watching my shorts. There's obviously some that are doing well, some that aren't. But it's it's a different outlet for me, right? I, I, I get to focus a different sort of energy. And within that one minute time frame, you would think it's really, really easy to, um, to put something together. And sometimes it's really hard. So like I said, I've been having a lot of fun. I'm, I'm trying, trying different ways uh, to make them interesting and fun. Uh, I mean, the nice thing with shorts is it does bring a lot of viewers to my channel that um, otherwise might not see my content. Uh, it's also great for subscribers, and it seems to be subscribers that are watching my other videos. Um, so yeah, like I said, the only the only the, the biggest difference I think going forward is I'm going to be omitting the the cooking stuff. Uh, let me know what you guys think about that. Uh, like I said, I haven't gotten a whole lot of traction in those videos, so I think for a lot of people, it doesn't really make a difference to them. And uh, like I said, you're going to see a lot more primitive stuff coming down the pipeline. I've been doing a lot of research, a lot of uh, learning. Uh, I know I was talking about showing uh, my bow building process, but honestly, I don't think I'm going to be doing that for a little while. The number one reason is there's... I'm just really just enjoying doing something with the camera off. I know uh, when I first started, I was watching, you know, like how to be successful at YouTube videos and, and all that kind of stuff. And they were saying, you know, sometimes you just gotta, you know, just gotta turn off the camera and do stuff for yourself. And um, 
bow building is that for me. It's kind of a, a, a form of meditation. I will always show you guys the bows I build. I will sh always shoot them. Um, but I'm, you know, there's so many good uh, boyers out there with amazing tutorials. Um, realistically, I'm still just an amateur, like a very beginner. So um, you're not, you're not gonna get the the best information from me just yet. Anyways. So anyways, um, let's talk about the giveaway. So the giveaway that I, that I want to do is, um, you know, this is something I've added to my fire kit this year and it's something I didn't even know existed and I want to pass it on to, to, to I want to pass one of these on to, to one of you guys. Um, so I'll show you what it is. It comes in this nice little container and you're probably wondering what the heck is that well it's a bellows so what this is is what you would use it for. I'm not gonna put my mouth on it I'll even clean this up um, but you blow into it and it obviously add, it introduces air into your fire and honestly at first I thought this was such a weird gimmick but on, since I've been using it it's, it's awesome you don't have to get right down in there you're not getting smoke into your face it's it's wicked so uh, like I said I, I want one of my awesome subscribers to uh, get this and then on top of this I would love to even get a short video from that said person um, using this that I could add to uh, one of my videos um, so to be enrolled in this giveaway all you have to do is I want to comment down at the bottom from you uh, just like I said just tell me what it is you want to see from this channel uh, you need to be a subscriber so if you're not a subscriber yet subscribe and let me know that you subscribe and I will put your name in a hat uh, just like I did last time I don't have no fancy uh, name generators or blah 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 I'm just gonna write down all your names gonna put it in a hat we're gonna draw it I'm gonna draw it right in front of you guys all right um, so yeah other than that don't really think I have uh, too much more I, uh, I want to say other than you know long weekends coming up so hopefully gonna get out for some bass I'm pretty freaking excited because smallmouth bass is like one of my favorite favorite fish to catch definitely want to hammer a couple of those on the old fly rod and other than that, I got Olivia's bow that I'll be showing you guys uh, that I built for her birthday, which I'm super excited about. I can't wait to see her face. And uh, yeah, this is going to be my video this week. Uh, unfortunately, I just haven't had time to, I have like I have some footage that I filmed, but I just, this week's just been hectic. It's Olivia's birthday this weekend. I've been trying to get her bow done. Also, the Habs are just fighting hard in the playoffs and I'm a big Habs fan so I've been watching them but uh, yeah so anyways like I said just write down in the comments what you guys would like to see and uh, let's let's move forward let's build this channel into something great because I said I'm really having a lot of fun uh, oh also uh, if you guys can just let me know if I talk too much in my videos don't talk enough explain enough like you know I'm down for constructive criticism just let me know what you guys think um, it seems every time I, I ask for a little bit of feedback I don't get much from people I'm really hoping this video just just does it um, so yeah like again like I said thanks to all the great subscribers uh, you know I I would I be doing this without you guys uh, probably but you know seeing my channel grow gives me a lot of optimism and a lot of uh go to 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 do more um like i said working on my my editing skills more and more it's definitely uh technology is definitely one of my weak weak things but uh yeah so anyways i'm gonna end it right there and hope to hear from you guys and can't wait to see who the lucky winner of this is going to be and, uh, yeah, I guess we'll catch you guys in the next one, all right? Thanks for watching.